My name is Francis Haysom from uh, Appledore Research. Um, we do research uh, specifically targeting the NFE, SDN, and cloud area of telco. Um, I'm going to briefly touch upon a, few, a couple of market highlights that we see in terms of the position, particularly in terms of automation, in terms of um, where we are today. Um, this slide is actually about two years old. We developed this um, with a major vendor in terms of just trying to trace the, the journey and the evolution um, of uh, NFE and SDN in terms of a, a journey ultimately to a cloud native environment. It's fair to say at the stage that we developed, it was very much we were in the land of the proof of concept, um, standalone, very um, autonomous um, areas of um, development. The good news is I think we've moved beyond that now. Um, we, we're starting to see uh, what's in clearly in blue um, ring fenced um, trials and, 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 and some use of um, software networks. Um, we're seeing typically, as I'll highlight some key points, we're seeing it being very much fitting into the existing OSS BSS environment of, of, of a telco typically. We're potentially seeing some aspects of lower capex in terms of business benefits that it is provi it's, it's, it's providing. But in terms of the things that we're doing with it, in terms of the automation, we, we are very much using the, these, these, these tools in, in a very traditional way in terms of develop, both in terms of products that we are um, developing, WANs or, or CPE, for example, um, and in terms of the way that we're, we're being dynamic in terms of the development of that. And we would highlight at this stage that there's, there's a great deal of uh, a leap, leap of changes of operational, as, as much as technology, as much of operational behavior that needs to be done if we are to move beyond the nice blue box and into the, uh, the future, ultimately, of a cloud native network, which is very, very, very scaled. In terms of just highlighting some of the challenges that we see in terms of making that leap from that blue, blue area is that everything about software-enabled networks promises a lot of moving from a, a very static environment to a much more dynamic, agile, agile environment. I, if I, I've lost count of the number of presentations I've heard agile in. Um, in, in these type of scenarios. But the challenge is if we look at the, the, the aspects of service agility, moving to much more online services, moving to um, less direct services and more working and collaborative models, if we look at the, the aspects of um, routing in terms of the, what the um, SDN does, or we look at the network functions in terms of what they can provide, and in terms of um, the aspects of using some of the DevOps um, capability, much of the existing way in which a telco works is actually br always bringing it back to a very static um, uh, position, in, in essence, in, the, in that, and I'll use one very uh, clear example, often when we, we've, we've introduced IP, and yet at the same time we've often nailed it down and, and lost its dynamics in order that we can still manage it within the existing framework of a, of, of a telco. And that is happen that the danger is that that could happen in other areas. So I'm hoping in, in terms of our challenge is to use, is to use automation to break that static um, hold. And hopefully the next three presenters are going to help us in terms of, of showing us aspects in which that can that can help and then occur. So with that, uh, adieu, I'll um, introduce Domenico uh, Covettino from HPE, who's going to talk about zero-touch operations, a reality. Thank you. Welcome.